darkness of the world. Thereafter, at the auspicious time for the appearance of the Lord, the entire universe was surcharged with the qualities of goodness, beauty, and peace. All directions appeared extremely pleasing, and the beautiful stars twinkled in the cloudless sky. The rivers flowed with clear water, and the lakes and vast reservoirs, full of lilies and lotuses, were extraordinarily beautiful. In the trees and green plants, full of flowers, the birds and the bees began chanting with sweet voices. A pure breeze began to blow, bearing the aroma of scented flowers. When the Brahmins ignited their fires according to the Vedic principles, the fires burned steadily. Thus, when the unborn Lord Vishnu, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, appeared, all the saints and Brahmins felt peace and the kettle drums vibrated from the upper planetary system. Look at this wonderful, amazing child. He appears to be fully decorated. Just see his beautiful curly hair, which decorates his all-attractive lotus-like face. No ordinary child can appear in this way. How wonderful it is that Lord Krishna has now appeared as our son. How wonderful it is that although the Almighty Lord has no father, he has taken birth in our family just like an ordinary child. My only misfortune is that I cannot celebrate his appearance while being kept in this prison by cunts. O oh, Almighty Lord, I can now understand who you are. You are the supreme absolute truth, the cause of all causes, and you have advented yourself to protect your devotees and to kill Kant and his followers. But as soon as he hears that you have been born, he may try to kill you. My dear Lord, I offer my respectful obeisances unto you. You are the original form of all incarnations, full of bliss, knowledge and eternity. My Lord, I request you to save me from the cruel hands of Kans. I am also very much afraid that he will try to harm you as soon as he hears you have appeared. My dear Devki and Vasudev, previous to this birth you had a strong desire to have me as your son, so I have now appeared just to fulfill that desire. I am very pleased by your devotion to me. I know that you are both concerned about my safety. Therefore, I order you to take me immediately to Goko and replace me with the daughter who has been born to Yashoda. Look, my chains have fallen off. The doors have opened and the guards are sleeping. Quick, Devki, give me the child. I must take him across to Goku as it is the desire of the Lord. My lord, please be careful. Maharaj, Maharaj, the eighth child of Devki is born. Come quickly. What? Oh no! Now the cruel death of my life is born! Come, let us go! <gasps> no, my dear brother! Please do not kill this female child! You are not to be killed by any female child! That was the omen! My dear brother, you have killed so many of my children! But I beg you to excuse this girl! Please let her live! Give me that child now! No! You rascal cunts! How can you kill me? The child who will kill you has already been born. 
somewhere else in the world. Do not be so cruel to your poor sister or else. My dear Vasudev and Dev Keen, I have acted just like a demon by killing my own nephews. I do not know what bad results I will incur. Because I believed in the prophecy, I killed all your children. My dear sister Dev Keen, you are a gentle soul. Please do not grieve in this way. I am so poor hearted. Please excuse me and show your compassion towards me. Hmm. It is now time that I ask my demon friends to go look for that eighth child of Devki and kill him once and for all. Ha 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 ha! Please hear. Wonderful tidings do we bring. O oh, residents of Goku and Gaboron. A son has been born to Nan Maharaj and his queen Yashoda. Please come and join the great festival of Shri Krishna Janmashtami. Shri, Shri Krishna Janmashtami ki jai! And now presenting the cast. Surag and Rishabh as the villagers. Shilpi, Vrinda and Tanvi as the demigods. Rohan and Abhi as the gods. Ranjini as Bhumi. Raghunandan Das as Brahma. Uma Devi Dasi as Durga. Angel Prabhu as Narad Muni. Golu as Lord Vishnu. Deepa as Devki. Shamanandas as Vasudev. And Ashish as Kans. <laughs>